Hello everyone, my name is Nieves Gomez, uh, CEO at Columbia Basin Health Association. I want to tell you a little bit about how COVID-19 has impacted this year's Color Run. Uh, we're going to change things up a little bit, but we still want to be able to provide a safe run for our communities. We believe the event is important, um, it hasn't changed, we are focusing on child wellness. Um, and when this year we're going to turn it into a virtual run. And I have AV here with us to explain to us a little bit about uh, what it's going to look like this year. Go ahead, AV. Thank you, Nieves. So a virtual race um, is definitely something that is the new trend. It allows you the capability of completing the course at your convenience. Whether you want to run, jog, or walk, you can do it at your own pace while also challenging yourself to finish at the best time. Um, the actual run will take place on Saturday, August 22nd and conclude on the following Saturday, August 29th. AV, what if I was one of the first 500 individuals to register for the event? You know, we're gonna have a two-day event where all participants can pick up their face mask and their race bib. Now, we are gonna do that at the Wajitas Elementary School from 10 to two. You can find us outside under the CBT tent. Now, if you're also one of the first 500 to register, you will pick up your free shirt that day as well. Um, also wanted to share that after you're done running, um, make sure you log in your finish time at runsignup.com where you'll also receive a digital finisher certificate um, as well as be considered for an Amazon Equidot prize which were given out to the first male and female who finished with the fastest time. Will there still be stations and color in the course? So this year we will not have color thrown at the station but along the course we will have six stations um, where each poster is available for you to take pictures whether it's a group photo or a selfie um, so make sure you check out all those uh, banners along the course. Don't forget to share your special moments on the virtual run on social media hashtag CBHA color run. I want to thank everyone for your support I know it's different this year we want to still continue with the event make it as safe as we can and we look forward to seeing every one of you. Thank you very much.